Good day, explorers, and welcome to a short IT class by Master Ogiwa. Today's topic is the history of hard disk drives. The hard disk drives are the devices that store information on our computers. <clears throat> okay, and so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, different hard disk drives and I have to place them by the ear. Uh, so, in the down of the computer age, actually, it is developing now, is the 50s, where we have this IBM 350 disk file that have been, this is the closest to a hard disk drive, hard disk drive during these times. Uh, now, the properties of this hard disk is a storage of 5 megabytes. This is, by this time, 5 diskettes. And with transfer speed of 9 kilobytes of characters per second. These days there were no pictures and things and all, everything was characters and symbols in computers. And so, then we are going to the 80s. During the 80s, the most popular hard disk drive have been with 20 megabytes of storage space and with a transfer speed of 1.25 megabytes per second. Now this is a big leap. And these were the times of the SCSI drives. I actually have a memory of these times. Uh, well, one day we reached the 90s. Ah, the 90s. The years of my fire days burning days. Uh, but, let's see, back then uh, was the ATA HDD uh, Parallel ATA Okay, the ATA is before SATA uh, This is serial something uh, Let's see, now this, these hard drives were with 340 megabytes average of uh, capacity and 5 megabytes per second transfer speed. Now this is transfer speed if uh, we want to copy files, move them somewhere else. This is the speed of the operation that is allowed by the hard disk because it depends on other things too. Okay, and then we are going to the tens to the, actually this is not the tens, the zeros of the new millennium, year 2000, where we had the uh, SATA, very popular now, then hard disk drive, uh, SATA 3 is after that, but let's see, these hard disk drives have been with 80 gigabytes of storage space and 150 megabytes per second. This is another big leap in the development of computer technology. Uh, we are then we are going to year 2010. Okay, year 2010 is the year of the SATA 3. Uh, and actually the SSDs have been on the market, but they haven't been that popular yet. So an average SATA 3 hard disk drive is with 2 terabytes of hard of uh, storage capacity and 270 megabytes per second transfer speed. Uh, okay, and uh, from here uh, we have standard SATA 3 uh, with 8 terabytes, even 16 terabytes by year 2023. Yes, we are, we are in year 2023 now. Uh, and I was thinking a lot of these uh, informational technology games on Planet 842 website will become a history games. 
But during uh, the 20s of the new millennium, we were presented uh, by the SSD drives. SSD. Uh, this is different technology. It is faster, but uh, have some disadvantages. In these days, uh, they are used uh, mostly for things that we need to access quickly, uh, like operational system systems and video games. Or at least this is my approach. Uh, it is to store operational system and video games on the SSD and the other things like movies, videos, other stuff I store on standard SATA hard disk drives. Okay, uh, but first release of these things was the NVMe SSD. Ah, actually, nee. uh, no, no, this is, uh, this is the first solid state drive. Okay. <laughs> I need to learn uh, with, uh, now this is with 120 gigabytes, but imagine the transfer speed is 3.3 gigabytes per second. Transfer speed, that means the computer access the information very, very quickly. Okay, and then we have this NVMe E, M, V, SSD, M2. I think. And uh, these days, there are a lot more modic modifications of the SSD drives. But this is the short informational technology class for today. And good day. I need to find out a way to finish this.